So we haven't done a webcam in a while, so, well, we're gonna do one today. We're doing one today, and this is the Mosanth. Mosanth 60 FPS 1080p webcam with microphone, autofocus, computer camera with three light colors. 50 bucks US, so that's, that's a decent price, I would think. Uh, the big one here, of course, autofocus, which is nice. Uh, as well as a light. So a light that's going to hopefully help light you up and it has of course some different uh, color temperatures. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to connect it to our computer here. We're going to see what comes in the box. Take a look at the specs. Not not in this order. Uh, and uh, see what the image quality is like because that's kind of kind of important, right? Most of us are buying a webcam possibly as a replacement for the webcam that's already in your computer. So we're, we're hoping that we get something better or we're hooking this into like a desktop computer that really doesn't have a webcam to start with. So quality can be important. So we'll take a look at this right now. All right guys, so right off the bat, uh, 60 ratings right now on Amazon for the Mosanth. Uh, four and a half stars, that seems seems decent, right? Uh, what, is it, what does it say here? Three light colors and stepless adjustable brightness. I'm with you. Uh, others, 1080p, 30 frames, this one is 60 frames. Is that a, I love how this is like blurry. It's, you know, depending on what you're looking for, it, Really depends on you know the what you want. I, I shoot these in 24 frames, even less than 30, because I want motion blur. Do I look like I'm blurry ever? No. So is it, yes, does it, it's, it's hard to say whether 60 can actually be better, if you get what I'm saying. And you guys are gonna be seeing this video actually in 24 frames. So you're not necessarily gonna see the 60 frames per second quality. So just, just so you guys know. Uh, fast and accurate autofocus, that's good, if that's if it's true, I guess. Built-in uh, dual noise reduction mics and a built-in privacy co cover. Yeah, 50 bucks. Not, not bad price. Here's the box, Mosanth 1080p autofocus. Auto, auto I almost went sideways there for a minute. And you guys can see what's kind of on the bottom of the box right here, somewhere right there. If you guys want to take a look at that, right? I don't know if it's if it's overly important. There's there's some there's some stuff on this side too. Again, if you want to just where am I right there? If you want to just take a take a gander, take a look at what it says. Again, I don't know if it's overly important, but where am I here? I'm just trying to make sure. There we go. That we're in focus. So we have. Uh, it looks like the camera itself. We'll just put that over there. We get a tiny, a wee tiny little tripod. You don't need much, these cameras don't weigh a whole lot. Uh, so um, it's nice that they throw something in. Plastic, right? Yeah. Will it hold this? Yeah, I'm sure. Uh, is it the best of quality? Would I put my expensive camera on it? No, but it's kind of a, a throw in, you know. Uh, cleaning cloth, that's kind of nice. And a little manual. So as far as the manual goes, fonts look decent enough. Uh, it tells you how to, Make it function, you know, and uh, how to how to use the, the the mount for the back. You guys can kind of see that right there. Yeah. So yeah, it's good. It's good as far as manuals go. I think I think it's it's okay, right? And nice long cable, which is excellent. I'm we only need it as far as the computer screen over here. You guys can see where the computer is sitting. And, but you could have it longer because again, you have a tripod mount, which is gonna be really good to get that. All right, and let's just, let's just get this on there. That's a nice, that's a lovely long cable for sure. Now, just so you, you guys can see this, bunch of little stickies on here. So I'll take the sticker off this. Just get it off there, okie dokie. And you have one that are on the lights. So peel those off. This can go on the tripod if you want to. We may, we're not sure. Uh, that's got a pretty good hinge to it. it. Would be nice if they gave you access to those so that you could tighten them. It looks like they're not really accessible. Little flip up there. And if we bring our computer a little closer here, 
you can kind of see what, we'll just kind of minimize that, minimize all this stuff. And and this basically, hopefully, can you guys see the top? This, this, this would just, I'll lay it down a bit, maybe right there, maybe you can see it there. You would just kind of take this and this kind of lays on the top there, right? And this can bend, so you can kind of just get it the way you want it so that when you straighten it back up again, it's, you guys can see it on the screen, right? It's pointing at you, so you just kind of get that however. I do like that this can swivel and tilt. You know, you can get it however you want once it's on there good. Yeah, that's decent, I like that. Now I have to see if I have, because it is, it is USB-A. So on this computer, of course, everything's USB-C. So I do think I have an adapter somewhere. I just have to find it. Found one. Yeah, of course, it's a Mac, right? So it is what it is. Okay, so we're screen capturing here. What we're gonna do is plug this in, just to give me my USB-C port. In we go. Anything happen up here? I don't know. Now it does have, hopefully you guys can see that, right there. It does look like it has a little uh, privacy screen. Yeah, so you can just pop that on and off. Depending, you can see the, hopefully you guys can see that, right? It closes up. So if you're concerned at all, you can close that. Okay, we are in there. So let's find, um, I don't know, what can we use here? Let's, let's bring up the old, maybe zoom, because that's what a lot of us would be using. Okay, and I'm going to go into my preferences here, I think. And you should be able to see video. I got a little blue light. USB camera, there it is. USB camera, right? Because I could switch that to FaceTime camera. There's a FaceTime camera. There's a USB camera. Well, that looks all right. Yeah, that's good. I think, yeah, so right on the front here, you guys, I don't know if you can see it, maybe in the top camera, right? Yeah, so it's right here, right underneath the lens, there's a little button that you can tap and it just kind of goes through the different colors. And it'll give you a little bit of extra light, way better than no light, you know? Oh, this, you can also, it looks like, you can also, on this side, just kind of slide up and down. So if I was there, right, on both sides, there's like little slide sensors that you just kind of slide over, or you can tap that. So you got a bunch of options. That's cool. Uh, so let's say I wanted this one. Touch up my appearance, yeah, just for low light, sure, whatever. No. Um, and that's 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 good. So let's pretend we were doing a new meeting. I just just so we can see it, right? Good. Yeah, the, like quality wise, that's that's pretty decent, I think. Again, I've got a pretty big light up here, but yeah, the the focus seems to like this focus on my hand there. And then it refocuses back here. It's got a, it's, it doesn't by any means have like a shallow depth of field or anything like that, right? So, uh, autofocus is great, but it's pretty much everything's in focus. But, resolution looks good, you know? We've got good resolution on the, on the, on the, on the beard hairs, right? A little bit of overexposure, exposure in here, a little tiny bit. But again, I got a really, really bright light just kind of sitting off to the side here, which most people wouldn't. Uh, I'm curious, let's just turn that light off just to see what it would be like, hold on. So now, now we're in a dark, this is a dark room, right? Dark room. So let's see what that light would be like. Any, does it, oh yeah, see that's helpful, for sure, right? And then I could be like, let's change it to more yellowy color, right? A little bit more of a both, and then off. Yeah, that's definitely useful. If you're like doing stuff in the dark at night, I didn't know how useful that would be, but that's, yeah, that's useful for sure. Okay, that's good. And you guys are seeing the image quality. Yeah, it's all right. And it's 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 decently wide. And I, again, I like the fact that you can just kind of angle this to be like, I just need to be centered more. I need to have it down a little bit or whatever it is that you want, you know, just, you can just kind of spin it around. Yeah. I'm okay with that. I'm putting this light back on, hold on. All right, so 
uh, I think I think that's all right. That's a win. You know, uh, it's it's a webcam. Now I say that, but we've tested some webcams before that were just like ah, it's it's okay. It's doable. It's passable. This one, this one, I would be fine with for sure. 1080, right? It says 60 frames, so it does feel like it's, at least what I'm seeing, it definitely feels smoother than some of the other ones. Uh, and it's probably that additional frames. Is that a, a, a super important to me? No, it may be important to you though. Let's say you are someone who's capturing this kind of stuff and like you're a gamer maybe, so you're capturing your games in 60 frames, you want your camera to match in 60 frames, so everything's got that same smoothness to it, right? So then, then I get it, 100%. You, you want your footage to match. All right, guys, uh, that's the, I don't even know what it's called now anymore. What is this called? Mosanth 60 frames per second 1080p webcam. Yeah, decent, for 50 bucks US, not, not too bad. And right now, save an extra 20% when you apply this coupon code. So that'll give you like 10 bucks off. Yeah, math. Yeah, they said I'd need it. Oh yeah. All right guys, I'm gonna leave you there. Links down below again. Uh, like, comment, share, subscribe. Hit that little notification bell. And we will see you fine folks uh, later on. That's it. Go buy something, I guess. I don't know. Watch another video. I'm gonna take this off my computer.